good day to everyone today i am going to tell you how to make the simple bed light with easy steps by yourself as i am mentioning that by yourself you are going to do this method is called as do it yourself um, obviously it is called as diy this term diy uh, we many of us we know this is a familiar term only but even though i will tell you what is do it yourself do it yourself is the method of developing or modifying or repairing things by oneself without the direct aid of professionals or experts that means that uh, by simply for an example in your home you can see some products some some small small products by by taking that products you are going to make some useful one useful uh, product uh, which can be used for some uh, daily life um, usages that is called a do it yourself this do it yourself concept i am going to explain you by reverse engineering method so first of all what uh, we supposed to know what is reverse engineering reverse engineering is a simple one that means that uh, by taking a final product you can see many uh, uh, the final product which is available in the market right that final product you are going to dismantle or deconstruct the final product that means that you are opening the uh, product uh, into several pieces and you are going to uh, study the uh, different uh, blocks in the uh, blocks present in the product uh, so you can understand the function or the operation of the product so this is called a reverse engineering so the concept of this video is i am going to explain you the do it yourself method uh, by reverse engineering concept so let us dive into the topic so in this uh, video you are looking at the uh, thing right this is the final product that i am going to make by diy method so this diy method as i told you already i am going to explain you by the reverse engineering so reverse engineering is nothing but of by uh, from the final to from uh, starting point we are coming so this is the reverse engineering simply so here this is the uh, bed light led here there is an led at the top of the uh, product this led you no know, which can be uh, see many of us we we used to uh, low light in the we wish to be in a low light in a night times when we are going to sleep when we are going to bed we used to see some uh, low light environment so that that kind of a people we can make use of this product so this does not need any complex wire sections complex wire connection and all simply we can plug into the ac plug point and uh, this led will glow in low light right in in low level so this is the final product and in this final product as i told you in reverse engineering i am going to dismantle or deconstruct the final product and into pieces and i explain you each and each uh, component present in the uh, comp, uh, final product that makes you understand clearly so first step i have opened the product i have dismantled the product so here the blue and uh, white uh, pieces are the outer portions which is used to cover the product Uh, and this center part no this is called uh, your led and this is the very important thing because this is the circuit uh, which is which works to uh, glow the led okay so here among these uh, i mean parts only the circuit part is very important than other things so let us take the circuit part alone and we will uh, study and we will learn how it works so this is the circuit part here we have two ac led leads input sections the input section one of the input section is connected to the diode uh, pn junction diode and uh, pn junction diode the uh, and which is connected to the led and led is another uh, terminal which is connected to the resistor and one more uh, diode is there which is connected to the uh, another point of the ac plug point so now next step i am going to draw the uh, circuit diagram for this uh, for this st uh, structure okay so here as i told you night right reverse engineering the from the final product we am we will be studying the uh, 
operations of the product by um, separating into the several pieces so here uh, from this final product from the final product i have drawn the circuit diagram here as i said we are giving the ac current alternate current positive and negative cycles are there so one section which is given to the uh, diode here as we are using two diodes i name it as d1 and as well as d2 so for um, ac input which is given to the one diode that is cathode terminal and anode terminal is given to the led and led is another terminal which is given to the 22 kilo ohm resistor which is used to limit the flow of current and this another terminal of the uh, 22 kilo ohm resistor which is given to the cathode of d2 diode and d2 diode anode section which is given to the ac input so this is the circuit diagram now let us see how the circuit is working first of all we, uh, before going to explain the before going to study the explain i mean working of the circuit diagram we you have to know the component uh, operation uh, which is involved in the circuit diagram here there are only major component are two components are there one is uh, 22 kilo ohm resistor and diode and one more thing is led that is led we we everyone familiar with the led that is just it is like a L, uh, i mean light so we no need to consider much about the led this is a load so we have to consider only this diode and as well as uh, 22 kilo ohm resistor so diode simply it allows the current in only one direction it will blocks the another direction and uh, resistor we already know it it is used to uh, control the flow of electron or control the flow of current to prevent the load to, from the damage so this is the thing you have you supposed to keep in your mind so come let us see the explanation how it it work, how the circuit works so here the input is given that is a alternate current is given so in uh, diode d1 uh, it, it it blocks the uh, it will blocks uh, this thing i mean input section because it is an reverse bias condition and uh, when it is in it when it goes to the diode d2 it allows the current in one direction only one direction current it allows and the 22 kilo ohm resistor which uh, limits the flow of current to the load the load is obviously the led so led for the led only one cycle only one cycle will be allowed to the led so according to that input it will glow finally so what we are making here is instead of giving the ac signal ac current alternate current directly to the led we are converting into a pulsating dc by making the by making this ac as a pulsating dc finally the load no load uh, uh, will operate in the pulsating dc condition because of that we can avoid the damage of uh, led from the ac supply we are converting this ac into dc supply so that the load can be utilized for a long days for long uh, i mean long time so this is the concept why we are using the diode over here so this is the function and finally no this the product i have checked in my room i have plugged into the plug point and uh, i put on this uh, i mean uh, switch and it is glowing perfectly and even especially in uh, night times it is giving not much intensity light it is giving a low light it will be very uh, i mean convenient when we are going to sleep so this you can make it by yourself there is no need of uh, such a complex circuit diagrams or uh, i mean uh, derivations problems and all not required so you can make it uh, by yourself even uh, not only the engineering i am student also uneducated people also you can do this kind of um, um, i mean do it yourself uh, product right so still i will i will uh, in further videos i will explain you i will tell you several, uh, different kind of diy products kindly support us so our channel is channel name is jagadish yam our caption is unknown to unknown because that why i have kept this caption as by uh, the unknown 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 things unknown engineering things or technology things i am going to explain you i am going to uh, explain by the known concept with the known concept i am going to explain the unknown concept this is the my objective of our channel and um, this was um, created by faculty members teaching faculty and non teaching faculty member and student member so kindly support our channel and uh, our, our motto is 
to uh, uh, technology and engineering to reach out uh, the uh, even the uneducated people or the layman people should understand the technology and engineering this is our motto so kindly support us and uh, give your valuable feedbacks in the comment section uh, in the youtube channel or to my personal whatsapp number thank you once again